Obviously, there's the village over there. I don't. I haven't really gone to the village in a while. I need to go back there at some point. Visit, kind of see what's going on. Hopefully, uh, oh, what the heck? Oh my gosh, this is an Enderman. Oh my gosh, I need, I, I need the Enderman. I actually need it. I don't. I, I just don't know. I, I don't want to. I don't have any armor. Oh, dude, I don't know what to do. I need it, but I don't want to. I don't want to risk dying. Okay, uh, let's uh, let's just eat the steak real quick. Let's see if the steak will strengthen my use of this iron sword. Protein is good for you. Wait, where is it? It just disappeared. Please don't disappear. I just hyped that all that from about me about me finding the internet. No, now I'm gonna lose like fifty percent of my audience. My ratings are gonna go. Okay, I'm joking. Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of my Minecraft Survival Let's Play series. So we are back in the survival world. Um, in the previous episode, we worked on um, our, uh, as you can see here, I've updated it, um, our river <laughs> sort of bridge. So basically, it's a bridge I made that goes all the way to the other side over there. That's where uh, kind of the forest is where I get my wood. So I wanted to make a bridge uh, to kind of get to there. And I think it looks really nice. I updated it a little bit. I had some stone bricks and I also lit it up to make it look nice. It looks really nice actually when it's uh when it's nighttime, which it will be very soon actually. So yeah, I mean I like it. It's nice and it's also nice to kind of have it like in front of my house. You know, you can just look at it every day. Um, and then in the episode before that, obviously I have my wheat farm here, uh, which is starting to grow a little bit. So let's harvest. And uh, obviously for a wheat farm, you can get tons of seeds from this, and you can use this to replant. And uh, it's not complete yet. I have to do that side. Um, I made it three rows, so let's just harvest all this. I remember like uh, w when you used to harvest wheat, <laughs> it would sound very loud. Luckily they changed that in the newer updates. All right, there we go. Right, this, this is, is this enough for this last row? Come on. I think it is, yes. That is good. It is now, okay, now the wheat farm is complete. There we go. Now it is complete. So yeah, we actually did basically accomplished something in today's episode. Um, but yeah, okay, we got uh, we got 20 wheat, that's nice. Um, I already made some bread before. Um, so I wanted to say off camera, but we're not really using a camera to record this, are we? All right, uh, let's make some bread. Let's, our, our first, our first is, okay, well not a dozen, but um, we got first bit of bread ever. So that's a, oh wait, wait I can make like another one right now. We have enough. There you go, eight bread. So there you go. So that is basically what we're gonna use the wheat farm for. And obviously, uh, once we start getting animals, we will breed them as well. That's the wheat is a very useful way of doing that. So um, animals like cows and sheep. Uh, but we'll we'll worry about that later. Um, today we have other plants. Now, <laughs> so this is actually not the first time recording this episode. I actually recorded beforehand earlier today. And it was basically me uh, digging uh, a new mining system, um, which is right over here. As you can see, it goes in here. Basically, I recorded the episode, and then I uh, I forgot to turn my mic on. So um, I could not use that. I still have the footage, and uh, here's some of the footage of me basically digging. Um, basically digging, um, uh, like, you know, uh, into um, underground and making kind of... Uh, uh, basically, the whole point of this is to make um, a straight mine, uh, so we can use that in order to find caves. It's it's a good alternative. Obviously, we could just explore like the overworld and everything, and find tons of caves. Even right now, you know, there's crazy like some crazy caves in Minecraft now. Uh, but this is nice an alter. This is a nice alternative, and also it's just you know, straight mine is basically just you dig tunnels around, and then you can potentially find resources. It's a very traditional way of mining in Minecraft. So I do want to make one of those. Um, but also, I do would like to use uh, this mine as a way to put a, a potential nether portal in here, uh, which will be nice. So you can go to the nether. If you don't know what the nether is, it's a different Minecraft dimension. So I, I would want to use it for that as well. Now, um, this here will actually not be where I will start, like, I'll dig out the tunnels. It will actually be a bit deeper, because over here, uh, this leads to an underwater cave, so I can't really build a tunnel that way. Um, and over here leads to, well, the, the river, there's a river over there, <laughs> a big lake, sorry, uh, or like a bay, so I don't, I can't really dig there anyway, so I think maybe the nether portal will actually be in this room, uh, this very room right here, um, obviously I'm not, that's not really my priority with this yet, 
Um, and also, uh, this way you can see uh, there's already like a bit of a cave system here. It's very small. It doesn't really go anywhere. There's a bit of a in like kind of a cave in here, but not really. Actually, I should probably block that up because I don't want any like monsters coming in here. Uh, well, okay, let's use Xandacite. I don't really use Xandacite for anything in Minecraft, so. Actually, I'll place a torch down. I don't... Actually, yeah, maybe I should place a few torches down because it's literally right underneath my house. I don't want monsters spawning in here, and then I can't go to bed. Okay. Let's, uh, now let's barricade this. There we go. <laughs> All right. So, um, obviously, I'll worry about the digging kind of portion later. I'll, basically, I'm going to dig deeper, try and build, like, another area where we can put put a bunch of tunnels. That'll be for later, and I'll probably show that in a future episode. I'll work on that. I don't want to bore you guys out with uh, digging too much. Um, but in today's episode, we're going to work on uh, basically just kind of, um, like, at least what I want to do first is actually make the kind of, like, the entrance to the mine look a bit nicer. Um, I dug out a little bit of a, a bit of a dirty over here. I dug out some land. Let me just get rid of some of these flowers. They look pretty, so don't worry, we'll use them for other things. Uh, but I realized I actually uh, <laughs> am running out of space in my house. I only have like, what are the two chests? I have a wide chest and a small one right there. Running out of space, so uh, okay, we're gonna need more. Okay, I have birch planks. Let's, uh, okay, let's make a spare, um, oh, actually no, I can't use birch planks because Birch wood is not as common as oak plan planks, and I would like to keep <laughs> my birch wood, uh, kind of pre preserve them. So I'm going to have to go mine some oak planks real quick. Uh, I guess we can go across the bridge, but we're going to test out our bridge, see if it's stable. You know, So we'll, we'll do that as an experiment. Okay, so I got my stone axe here. We're going to go. Let's use the bridge. This is going to be a very tension-filled moment. Does the bridge work? Oh my gosh, is it working? I don't know if it's working. It worked. Oh my gosh. Who could have thought? Okay. Well, I mean, okay. I don't think there was really much of a surprise that was going to happen there. Um, but anyways, uh, let's go mine some wood. This is basically uh, sort of my orchard for now. Um, obviously, at some point, it will go extinct if I keep mining everything. So I will have to start replanting some saplings. But this is uh, my basically my orchard where I just collect a bunch of wood. It's really very useful to have nearby. Um... Obviously, there's the village over there. I don't. I haven't really gone to the village in a while. I need to go back there at some point. Visit, kind of see what's going on. Hopefully, uh, oh, what the heck? Oh my gosh, that's an Enderman. Oh my gosh, I need. I, I need the Enderman. I actually need it. I don't. I, I just don't know. I. I don't want to. I don't have any armor. Oh, dude, I don't know what to do. I need it, but I don't want to. I don't want to risk dying. Okay, uh, let's uh, let's just eat the steak real quick. Let's see if the steak will strengthen my use of this iron sword. Protein is good for you. Wait, where is it? It just disappeared. Please don't disappear. I just hyped that all that from about me about me finding the internet. No, now I'm gonna lose like fifty percent of my audience. My ratings are gonna go. To okay, I'm joking. Anyways, no, the, the Enderman, the Enderman just escaped. But yeah, um, if you're wondering why I need the Enderman, well, um, I would like to go. I'm going for it. Go for it. No, get back here. Get back here. No, where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Why is he running away every time I'm charging towards him? Where is he now? Maybe I should just pretend like I don't care about him, and then he'll come back. It worked last time. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay, let's, uh, okay, look, we totally forgot about that Enderman, right? Yeah, okay, the Enderman's not, totally not gonna come back again, so we're just gonna go carry on. Oh, dang it. Okay, let's just, <laughs> let's just focus on the priority. All right, but yeah, if, um, basically, I need an Enderman base to get Ender Portals, because I would like to, oh, why don't we need to go to the house? But yeah, I would like to build, <laughs> um, um, or sorry, not build, um, get, um, an Eye of Ender. Basically, an Eye of Ender is the source, well, the main thing we need, I have Eyes of Enders, um, we need those to basically activate an end portal, which is somewhere in, around the Minecraft world, it's, uh, it's in a stronghold, and, uh, we can use that, why am I going outside, okay. We need that in order to basically complete the portal so that we can go to the end. 
the end is a dimension. I'm sounding very educational. The end is a dimension where where it's there's the end of dragon. So I would very much would like that because I would do want to actually be sort of the game in this world. I think that'd be pretty cool. And fun fact: so even though I've played Minecraft for probably ten years now, most of my life, I have yet still to uh, beat the Ender Dragon, and I'm hoping this will be the series, the time where I actually do it. Okay, guys, I I promise you, there'll be the last time where I just randomly go out my get out of my house. All right. So now let's focus on our mine. So, hmm. Okay, what can I use? Um, okay, cobblestone could be one option. Polished and aside. Oh, actually, that's nice. Let's uh, let's make quite a bit of those. Um, and granite. Polished granite. I don't know if that will, I don't think that looks, that, that will not look good in my opinion. So we don't need that. Okay, polished and aside and cobblestone. Okay. I will definitely need to collect more wood later. Off video or something. Because, uh, I don't have that much. <laughs> Okay, let's see what we can make here. So, hmm. I think kind of the entrance. Let's make, okay, let's make the entrance kind of out of polished and decide. There we go. Look at that. It already looks amazing. I know. Okay, actually, let's take out the corner here. That's something I usually tend to do <laughs> for building. Hmm, okay. And then let's make these out of planks. I know I'm low on planks, but I mean, I'll gather more later, don't worry. Okay. Then we can put some more and decide here. Okay, no. I don't want that. Okay. Hmm, okay, what should we do in here now? Let's, uh, okay, let's put some wood here, some wood planks. Okay. Cobblestone. Where I don't know where to put the cobblestone though. Where would I put that? Hmm. Okay. Wood here. Should it just be okay? Some wood here. Cobblestone. Okay. I'm thinking like maybe should we use like slabs here or something to kind of like add some sort of design to it? Hmm. We could, we very much could, but let's just uh, dig up like this for now. Okay. Okay, I think I'm seeing what this I could do with this. It's kind of like stripes. Uh, no, actually, I don't like that. Polished and aside there. Hmm. Okay, I mean, doesn't look bad. Doesn't look bad at all. It looks pretty... It looks fine. Okay. Why does it have to be nighttime already? Hmm, but I would like to add some slabs here. So, um, okay, let's go get ourselves a crafting table. Actually, I'm going to take one out and just kind of put one out here. Okay, let's see what we can craft. Okay, polish and andesite slabs. Okay. And then, wooden, sorry, oak slabs or, yeah. Okay. Then just pull some polish down inside there. There we go. Okay. All right. I think that looks nice. Yeah, it's like just like it's kind of like you know has a bit of a. I'm trying to. I, I was trying to create a combination, you know, between cobblestone, polished down inside, and wood. Um, I, I think it kind of gives out that feeling of it feeling like kind of like a interest to a mine. Although it looks a little bit more nicer, which I mean isn't exactly a bad thing. So I'll take that. Let's go to bed real quick. But let me just check my chest real quick. Do we have like any other resources we could use? Birch slabs. No, I think that would make it look a little bit too nice. I, d I have two stone brick slabs uh, from when I actually uh, used it for um, the bridge. So I only have two. I don't know if 
that's enough to do anything. Hmm. Do you have an andesite? I don't know if andesite. Uh, sorry, not andesite. Uh, granite. I don't know if granite's really. Uh, I don't really like the look of granite. Polish, even polished granite. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know about that. Hmm. Don't I have? Don't I exactly have that much building supplies <laughs> right now? Hmm. Most of it just. Okay, actually, yeah, I like that. I like that. Okay, that's nice. Okay. Well, I mean, it's passable. Uh, I don't want to. I don't want to <laughs> put too much self confidence in myself. But um, yeah. Okay. No. Not definitely not a birch door. I would like. I would like a spruce door. That actually would be nice. Cause I don't know. It kind of feel. I feel like it would kind of give that feeling better of it feeling like a, kind of an entrance to a mine hmm unfortunately i don't have one i think for now we're gonna have to stick with an oak door do i have an oh yeah i do actually have an oak door right here so let's go plop this down plop <laughs> there we go okay i think that looks decent it looks like a decent <laughs> entrance to a mine what do you guys think? Uh, obviously, if anyone's watching this, let me know in the comments. I, I'm hoping that it's good. I'm hoping, hoping that it looks appealing, <laughs> uh, and most importantly, kind of looks like an entrance to a mine. Um, I would like to do something in the front. I do want to make like pathways soon connecting certain, you know, locations to each other. So uh, that I will probably do that that off camera, make it look a little bit nicer. Um, but there we go. This is the entrance to the mine. And then you kind of go down here. I would like to maybe change the walls here a little bit inside. Um, so then you can kind of go in here. And then obviously it'll kind of look a little bit more like a cave. So that's what I'm going to do. But yeah, I think that's the entrance of the mine complete. The next thing I would like to do is actually kind of place down some slabs here. Uh, I'll probably use cobblestone stairs because it's just easier to make. And I don't really care if it doesn't look nice. It's a mine. A mine doesn't have to exactly look super nice. Okay, uh, let's see how much we can make. I can make. I can. I can make polished andesite stairs if I wanted to. I do have quite a bit, but I don't think that's gonna be enough. How much can I? Oh, I can even just make regular andesite stairs. I'm. I'm not gonna use it. Um, I'm probably just gonna make cobblestone stairs. Well, I only got thirty-six. What? I still have tons of cobblestone. Let's see. Okay, let's see if we can make like a whole stack. There we go. We got a stack in uh, 36. Let's see. Um, obviously, um, it actually will. I will probably need more as we will constantly. Con we will. I'll probably keep digging down this big staircase to like to bedrock. That's something I used to do a lot when I used to, uh, play my <laughs> Minecraft Survival Worlds. Just take all the way down to bedrock. So I'm going to do that again here. Carry on my, I guess, traditions. <laughs> okay. There you go. Let's at least make the staircase leading down here to this. To I'm going to call this the the main base of the of this mine, this mining system. There we go. All right. Uh, I think what I will have to do here, let's just dig out this bit. Let's just see there's some grass there. <laughs> okay. You go this bit here so then it kind of looks a little bit nicer when we go down and up. Okay. Okay. Yeah, this is where I got a lot of... There's, there's a, tons of bandside here, surprisingly. I wasn't expecting this much. Yeah, the, this looks much better. All right, I'm going to have to break the rest of that later. But yeah, there we go. Cobblestone stairs leading down. An easy way to get up and down the mine. Very nice, very easy. And I also continue digging down this way. And uh, yeah, I'll probably keep you guys up to date with how it will look and everything. Now, when it comes to actually mining, I would like to save that for when I find a cave. I don't want to have to spend a whole episode where I just uh, kind of straight mine <laughs> down. It doesn't really sound that fun. I would like to actually do it in a cave. So I will probably do kind of straight mining by myself, all that. Um, but, you know, I'll still try and figure out how I can make it so that it could be entertaining, you know.
because I do want to try and make everything as entertaining as possible. So you have to kind of be concerned about these things. But overall, I think we still uh, had a pretty good, <laughs> pretty good um, uh, time uh, building a uh, nice entrance to the mine. Um, and I'm hoping uh, we can do more with this. And uh, yeah, in the next episode, I will probably uh, show you guys more of what I've done with the straight mine. Um, and uh, yeah, I mean, I don't exactly know what 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 exactly else is gonna happen, uh, but you'll find out soon. Uh, but yeah, thank you for watching this episode, and uh, yeah, have a good day. Bye.